Just fantastic. I mean, we had two, you know, two games midweek here. We got some guys banged up on the mound. We needed every bit of everything he gave us out there. We were hoping for two. He gave us three. Uh, pitched great and helped his own cause. And I think he hit a ball out that might have hit him if he didn't swing at it. But uh, like Benny's been doing it for us for you know four years, and it's just just really fun to watch him perform on the field. How many ten run innings have you been a part of in your career? I I have no idea. Um, you know, you just this game's so crazy. You just you just play and. You know, we we didn't exactly pound the ball around the place. We used the whole field. We found holes. You know, we took advantage of a mistake they made defensively, and, and uh, you know, we got some big hits. But it just you just keep playing, just win pitches, and, and you know, let's, <laughs> we're at the mercy of this game. You just you're on the good side of that sometimes, the bad side. Unfortunately, we're on the good side. Is a win like tonight that much sweeter against another Nebraska team? No, I, I mean. I couldn't treat any game more the same. I'm sorry for the boring answer, but I, we respect everybody exactly the same. I don't differentiate in-state, out-of-state, home, away. It just doesn't matter. You know, We're going to come and get ready to play. Or we're going to reset and do it again tomorrow. It doesn't get you anything tomorrow. If anything, it gives you more challenges by maybe being overconfident, but uh, our boys know what, what they need to do to get ready. With those competitive at bats, I mean, is that when you really start to see kind of string in innings together that you guys seem to be doing a little bit more recently? No doubt about it. They feed off each other, did a real nice job of staying over a few breaking balls and change-ups and maybe two strike counts. And again, using the whole field. We're not spinning off of balls. You know, we, we just, uh, there's too many to really pick out. But, you know, you can't really control where it goes as far as a defender making a play. But when you're using the whole field, you give yourself a fighting chance. And, you know, we, we got a, you know, we had two home runs, probably two doubles, that's it. But other than that, I think they only gave us two walks. So kind of had to hit our way on. But when you when you, when you you have a good approach, you got a fighting chance. You guys find in a little bit of a groove, you think? Just, um, I mean, mm, the wind would say something. Yeah, I don't know. It's, I'll give, like over the weekend, I would say that, that we didn't necessarily play our best baseball. We took a lot of bad swings and good counts. We made some mistakes. But one thing this team is, is starting to understand is how to continue to fight and, and make plays when you have to in tough situations. And it's kind of getting a little bit of, you know, a little character in those situations. And they're kind of kind of excited and thriving on those challenges. So I'll put up with a couple mistakes when you got that kind of mentality. You guys didn't have to get too deep in the bullpen over the weekend. But, I mean, with, with five games and six days or so, I mean, what, what's kind of the challenge for you guys this week and making sure that those stay lined up and yeah, on, on, on pace there? You're right. I mean, this is our last double, you know, game midweek and trying to figure it out. I mean, we're – we're, we're, we're pretty thin and, and um, you know it's it's something where you try and maximize everybody but minimize their workload so they're ready for the weekend you know we, we were planning on using most of our main guys today uh, well now we're gonna have to do them tomorrow so it's gonna be uh, uh, creative how we do it and hopefully we're efficient and uh, can get through the game and not play 20 innings is Coda a guy that you can rely on now on weekends to, to maybe be that guy in the middle innings you know, his, his thing, you know, it's always been the consistency of command, and, and he struggled through some of this stuff there, and he got out of it, but he's always had a great arm, but it's just a matter of harnessing it. And, uh, you know, he, he, last year we had a couple situations where he got some huge outs for us when we were a little short and, you know, a couple different games. I think it was an Omaha game, actually, and the LMU game here where he pitched three innings and was really big. So, you know, he's he's done it. Uh, we just need him to do it on a little more consistent basis. Get a guy for tomorrow night yet, or are you going to? Uh, we'll start Ethan Frazier tomorrow, okay. and then we'll have you know guys lined up behind him and see how it goes. Coach Angelo Alderville had another great night. What what's really stood out to you about his performance, not just tonight but this season? Well, one, he works hard. Two, he likes to compete. Uh, at the plate, he's he uses the whole field, so he gives himself a fighting chance. Uh, defensively, he's always had really good hands. Uh, he's just doing a nice job of moving his feet, and and he just understands where to be on the field. Uh, and last year, you know, he didn't play much last year, but when you have a whole year and you're not playing much, you have a choice of either pouting and complaining or getting better. And obviously he got a lot better. And, you know, some guys want to go play summer ball. Some guys don't. Some go out come back. This guy wasn't getting enough playing time at a place, so he was begging to go find another team to play more. The guy just wants to play. And when you want that, you, you get better. Any other questions, guys? Another in-state game tomorrow against UNO at Warner Park. What are you looking forward to? Being in a baseball uniform on a baseball field, it's a sweet field. I love it. I yeah, I I don't it doesn't matter. I don't care who we're playing. We're gonna go out and prepare to play a baseball game and try and take care of our business and win pitches. Anything else? Okay, bring Ben. Yep.